As far as I know, in Los Angeles, the uh, Freedom House, Casa Libre, is about the only agency that is purposely serving unaccompanied minors. We're talking about the 10,000, the 10% that can't return home because they've been abused, um, either sexually or their parents are using drugs or they've been beaten up or whatever. So they're not just runaway, they're throwaway. So unaccompanied minors are just, uh, nobody's aware of them when it comes down to it. These children encounter a, an Alice in Wonderland world in which they're, despite their status as children, they are generally not considered eligible for services by local departments of children's services. When undocumented children finally make it across the border, which is an exceptionally difficult thing to do because of the militarization and the criminalization, of the border during the past decade. Um, they may or may not face apprehension by the Department of Homeland Security during the past year. Approximately 8,000 children were apprehended by agents of the Department of Homeland Security. And one could guesstimate that another 16 or 24,000 were not apprehended and are living on the streets of the United States. And some live in cardboard boxes in the fields and engage in agricultural work most had for the major cities, um, many of in search of relatives who they never find. And they've chosen to leave the family. Can you imagine leaving the family? These are not children who are, are, are leaving their communities, leaving their homes, leaving their families, leaving their countries in order to come to Los Angeles to find fame and fortune. These are not runaway children. These are children who have left their homes and their families and their communities, usually for pretty desperate uh, reasons, reasons relating more to survival than, than pleasure. They're not coming here for vacations. They're coming here to survive.